With an undefeated record of 7-0-0, Casey Kademi is fighting for his first European title. Kademi is looking to break various records on the night, which comes with a huge responsibility when you represent an entire community. And I'm like the fourth or the fifth Afghan boxer in the UK, but I'm the first Afghan boxer to, to win my 10 rounder, and I'm the first one to fight for the European title in, from Britain. And um, I'll, if I, once I win my title, which I will, uh, I'll be the first ever Afghan to win under 10 fights. So that's the history in making, and uh, we want to be the first Afghan ever to get a world title, Afghan British to, to get a world title. And um, yeah, man, so Afghan is where I was born, and Britain is my country. So. And I represent both of them, both flag ups. Johnny Eames, professional boxing coach, has been supporting Kademi in the preparation for what is the biggest fight of his career so far. And uh, I like to think now I'm like his, his, his second father, to be honest with you. Because mm -hmm. he took a little bit of straightening out of things he does. And um, he had a lot of distractions in his life. Yeah. And hopefully we've, we've, we've crossed that hurdle. And, and, he's, and he's, listen, there's no one more dedicated to him, than to boxing than him. But he just had a lot of distractions outside of the gym, yeah. which he's getting right now. In preparation for the top of the veil fight, professional boxer Lucian Reed has been putting Casey through his steps. However, a friendly encounter wasn't always in the cards. How did we meet? I remember, I remember there was a little bit of rivalry back in the day because it, it was, wasn't it? Because I remember he was coming up and I'm sure one of the boys went, oh, you're fighting Casey from Peacock. I was like, oh, who's that? He was like, mate, he's unbelievable. And when I got in there in the amateurs, he was... It was exactly the same how he is now. He's, he's elusive, he's powerful, he's, he's, um, he's very, very quick. So I had to up my game massively in the amateurs. And then I'm fortunate enough to have to spar him and he's um, helping him out for this championship fight for it he's got. So um, I'm, I'm just proud I know him because he's a lovely fella. His fight against Pedro Matos will be held on the 14th of December at York Hall, East London, for what is the biggest fight of his life. Fabian Berra. Sonny's Sport News.